is the day's daily devotional reading from Vitality for Daily Living, authored by the Prophet Daniel Ejako Afari. Today is Sunday, 30th of July, 2023, and the theme for today is Should Children Be Disciplined? Our anchor scripture will be taken from Proverbs chapter 23, verse 13 to 14. And I read, Withhold not correction from the child, for if thou beatest him with the rod, he shall not die. Thou shalt beat him with the rod, and shalt deliver his soul from hell. Those who discipline their children are the ones whose children behave well. Where there is lack of discipline, children do what they like. They grow up not respecting adults nor knowing how to talk to others. Sometimes, due to immaturity, the child is not aware of bad results of his behavior. But when discipline comes in, there is, a ch- there is a complete change. Parents should know that the rod is not always the king, but the different forms and ways of correcting children. Whatever form of correction being applied, the motive is to put the child on the right path. Okay, brother. So, like, we are taking it once again from the inspiration. So, copy that. Now, the inspiration. Many think that when love is really at work, there must be no idea of punishment. The Bible says. Foolishness is bound up in the heart of a child. The rod of discipline will remove it afar from him. Proverbs chapter 22, verse 15. Our human nature is such that if we are left without any form of discipline, we shall divert our course and go our own way. Discipline is aimed at removing the wrong habit. The fact that we apply the cane doesn't mean that we don't love the child. That's correction in love. It is not meant to inflict pain upon the child's body and let him suffer. The intention is to produce a child with good morals. Those who discipline their children are the ones whose children behave well. Where there is lack of discipline, the children do what they like. They grow up not not respecting adults, nor knowing how to talk to others. Sometimes, due to immaturity, the child is not aware of the bad results of his behavior. But when discipline comes in, there is a complete change. Parents should know that the rod is not always the king, but the different forms and ways of correcting children. Whatever form of correction is being applied, the motive is to put the child on the right path. Now let's pray. Lord, teach us to correct our children in love. Amen. Read the Bible in one year. For today, read Psalm chapters 59 to 61 and Acts chapter 28, verse 16 to 31. Thank you. Thank you.